So it's not even delay, it's just like fucking it didn't show up at all. Don't blame me, blame Twitch. Nah, fuck it. Alright, should I start in Lin mode or go straight to like Hector? Let's get Lin some extra levels. Whoa, shit, dude. Like a billion things just showed up on my screen. What just happened? Oh my god, that's like 20 messages. Nils is Negril, guy max strength, fuck. Screw FE7, play FE7, 4chan classes, what the fuck? Twitch, please. Um, FE7, 4chan classes is not a bad idea. But I feel like just playing this game. I'm a girl, because it's a girl's only playthrough. And my name is Marco, which is a beautiful female name. And I'm going to do wind, because I like Lynn. Lynn will be my main lord for this playthrough. It will be Hector plus girls. Let's close in and attack. No. Oh, he hit me. Son of a bitch. The odds of that are only one in... Okay, they're actually pretty good. Oh well. I don't think I've ever in my entire life actually used um, all my vulnerabilities. Oh, I got a strength. I got like the le I got the exact same level up you get in easy mode, or rather normal mode. The the fixed level up of the first level. Mark greater than Robin. What are all these words? Footsteps of fate. Neither of those characters are girls, unless I will not be using them. Whoa, the crit. My Lin is going to get to a highest level by the end of this. As she does. She's already gotten a pretty good amount of strength. Which is nice. I think she's had... Oh no, she's only gotten one strength. Mm, this guy's going to chuck me up real bad if he hits me. And he did. God damn. I've used an entire vulnerary. The gayest thing about normal mode in Lin is that it doesn't take into account... Like, there are some incredibly unlikely hits that you're guaranteed in, in hard mode. I mean, in normal mode, that you're not guaranteed in hard mode. And also, uh, Sane never gets his sword, which is really annoying. Because he starts with a lance, then you get a sword. They really should have thought that through. It's a little tiny piss off. Yes, my level ups are doing sick. Then is this is gonna be a good playthrough. Lynn's running out of sword. It's okay, she's gonna get the mini caddy in a second. I've always wanted to like hack a thief into my game and open that door. Although I already know what would happen, the door would disappear and then nothing would happen. But it'd just be cool to open that door. Uh, if I let this guy attack me, I have a pretty good chance. Yeah. More strength? Is this enough? Alright, here's where I get my first not Lin girl. I'm gonna hurt this guy. Just so I can kill him with Florina. Florina will be the other character that I use in this mode. Lin one-shotting people. Lin one-shotting people. I'm going to give her Kent's sword. Um, trading line. Here, so I don't get sniper e -note. No strength that time. That was a bad level up. Oh, 
I got a pretty good shot at this one. Yep. That was bad. A boring level up. Right, let's see what we got for this guy. Mm, let's buy an iron sword. Oh, this guy will fuck me in one hit. Got a minimal chance of hurting him. Florina just can't do it. Planning on doing Ellawood's story too. I will almost definitely do um, Hector's. I will use Hector and all girls. It will be hard not to use Hector. I'll probably do Hector hard to be honest. I haven't decided yet though. I don't really like Hector hard that much. It tends to kind of just be cheap rather than difficult. I'm just going to kill him. Ah, boring level up. Dude, who are all these people? Congo Kokoretz is on. This guy's got KKZ in his name. He must be from my third strike. You start with Rebecca. That's true. There's no way in Hector's might to start with a girl. I guess I'll recruit everyone still. This is a level where it's very hard to do everything with just a girl. So, I won't. God damn it, I really wish I had swords. But I don't. First order of business is to kill the archer. Second order of business is to recruit Dorcas. I heard it was Dorcas, and then I heard it was Dorcas. Now I just don't know what... I've had Natalie die in this mission before. That's how much of a scrub I am. Oh, the crit. I can't even kill that guy. I'm just going to wait. Kent has a Vulnery. I can pass it back and forth between them. Honestly, I ought to give this Vulnery to Sane. Because he's going to need it. I'm not doing anything with Rebecca this turn, so it doesn't matter. Um, there's no reason not to do this. Got my iron axe. I'm going to use lots of vulnerabilities. Every time I do this, I feel like I accidentally shoot that wall and it's like fucking awful. Kenry, you got a, you got a, you got a R4. I just read that. That's cool. Congrats. Iron axe is two shot these guys. With Florina's starting stats. I always feel like in this mission, even if you all your characters ha like get no stat ups, you can still do this mission. Um, you can kill every single enemy. And every time I do this mission, I like make it my goal to kill every single enemy. It's always something fun. Every playthrough. Do my best to kill everyone. That guy won't even die. Zane is so strong. Ugh, that had a lot of damage. That had a lot of damage. It'd be really cool if I could hit this guy. Cool. Uh, I ought to heal, honestly. There are better as wyverns, I agree. They should be wyverns.
Lynn needs a horse, give her the horse. Kent's dying. Kent died. God damn it. What am I supposed to do to prevent Kent from dying right now? Oh, I could move Lynn to... Alright, here's an idea. I could pull some guys with Lynn. That should work, actually. I think. I don't know, actually. That's so annoying. It's because Kent doesn't have his sword. That's literally the reason. Let's turn 5 out of 7. Even Florina gets hit. 1, 2, 3, 4. 5, 6. Times. She will not die. Unless it's okay to attack these guys. Got strength. Dude, they're both attacking Ken. It makes sense now. Is that what happened last time? Alright, maybe if I... Hmm, what's this guy's strength? 13, 11, 11, 13. It's not quite safe to attack this guy. Oh, it's especially not safe to attack that guy. Dude, am I just phoned? What do I do? Alright, let's affect the RNG. Holy fuck, why do I have to do this in this game? Especially this soon. Doesn't feel right. Kent and Sane drop their weapons. That would actually work. That would actually work. Sarah Bagan's fucking strategic master. Holy fuck. What a great idea I just didn't do. That would be I'd be taking less damage every turn. And I would also be getting hit less often. I can't, dude. Alright, you win. Let's do this. I don't need these. This feels weird. <laughs> Whoops, Kent. That's already... I didn't think it through. I already fucked up. I've never had to do this for a playthrough before, but like, I've always known that it is something that you can do. A really interesting strat. Damn it, Florina got a strength. I know it's gone. Ah, oh, now it's gone. Oh, I missed. I'm not going to kill every enemy in this level. Not this time. Oh god, he kills me in one hit. Whittle him down. I'm surprised I don't even have a custom message. It feels like they should. Oh, Lin's so based. Last turn. So this wall's not even going to get destroyed, but I didn't even get to kill that guy. Which is a shame. Um... Can this guy... I get to kill one person no matter what. Unfortunate. Just keep my weapon used to a minimum. I guess I'll waste some hand axe. Yeah, I think if... Well, if Kent and Sane have swords, they're dramatically better off, obviously. But, um... There's other factors. I got Sarah. People who know me know that Sarah is my favorite character. This is a good mission to get all my experience with uh, characters I don't care about. And by characters I don't care about, I mean characters that are low level. Eric, you're a piece of shit. Florina not getting good level ups. Starting to scare me. I need Florina to get good level ups. Need to make this guy attack Lin. Sarah no. Florina needs to kill everyone. Okay, dude, I'd, every playthrough I'd suddenly realize that like everything is wrong. Auto cursor needs to be off. Red is a nice color, I suppose. No, that looks fucking awful. 
Green is a nice color, I suppose. Oh, Lin could have killed two. God damn it. Fucking you should be playing this game, not me. Look at my hit rate. That's bad. Um, let's bait over this guy. Nothing like meat shield Lin. Whoa, he hit me. Well, this guy one-shot me. He does 10 bonus damage, right? He's got attack power of 9. So that shouldn't kill me. Even if... If anything. And then he kills Sarah. That would be bad. Yeah, that did nothing. By nothing, I mean most of my health. Better not be able to move there. Cool. Good. Good. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I got a crit. Slim Lance. Dude, I can't get stir. She's got like four level ups and I can't get stir. Uh, I could just use the, ener the energy ring on her. That's really unlucky. I'm gonna fix some level ups to get her some stir. I think. I think I'm gonna force it. Can I even kill this guy? No. Yes. It's gonna be ugly, but it's gonna be doable. I should definitely attack him from the forest. Am I gonna die? No. No, I'm not. This is probably the easiest boss in the entire game. Since you have like two characters who can attack from a range. That was, oh, I got a fence. So that's not shitty. But still. I missed him. No, but seriously, this is the easiest boss in the entire game. Alright, Florina, you're going to get some strength. One way or another. That's not strength, that was resistance. That's not strength, that's speed. Hell, if I really wanted fucking a good level up, I'd scum for her. That was defense, that was kind of cool. Her defense is usually a little lacking. I ought to bind load state, because I hate like going from my controller to F function keys. Oh, I killed him. But I didn't do anything. I'd rather not kill him. One of these times I'm just going to miss, and I'm going to not even level up. I'm surprised I've been hitting all of these. It's like a 73% chance I should be missing uh, one out of four. Oh, what a level up. Let's flare in anyway. She's light. Wait, hold on, I could, I could stay there. Let's heal again anyway. I missed him that time. I won't even kill him, so it doesn't matter. Alright, what are my chances of killing him with the Slim Lance? Pretty good. That was a shitty level up. I got skill and resist. Skill is the one thing that um, Sarah does not have over Lucius. She's better in like every other way. But Lucius has a lot more skill. I think Lucius has slightly better defense too, but I forget they both have piddly defense. Whatever. Bah, you're all scum. I'm 
neither of the characters I get in this level are women. In fact, do I have all the women I'm going to get? I think so. I suppose I'll just use uh, Flynn to do it to do everything. Oh god damn it! She was right about to level up. I'm gonna redo this mission. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know, but I forgot. All right, let's try this again from the top. Oh yeah, I didn't mention, but I've only got until 1 p.m. to stream, and Pacific Standard Time, it's already 11.40. I've got an hour and 20 minutes. I'll be back. It's not like I'm going to be gone all day, but I do have a class I need to go to. The crit. The no strength. Florina, her strength might be the worst of the three Pegasus. I didn't even affect RNG. Her strength might be the worst of the three Pegasus, but um, I'm not sure. It definitely starts the lowest. Because she comes in at the lowest level. I'm actually willing to take that. Who should get the... Um, who should get the, the angel bullshit? Angelic robe. Sarah, Lynn, or Florina. It's good on any of them. I will leave it to a chat vote, which will probably be Sarah Vagans. If you tell me to put it on Matthew, I'll kill you. Ah. That's how cute Florina is. She says, ah. Chop, chop. Oh, that was fucking awful. When did I last save state? That's not good. So I guess I'll just leave that. Whatever. This can just be the playthrough where I get shit level ups. Do you have improved growth rates in hard mode? Someone told me you did, but I don't know if I believe that. Oh, I've got to drop something. Let's drop the door key. I'm honestly, like, it's like impossible to use all of Matthew's lockpicks in Lin mode. I think it's literally impossible. Here we get the angelic robe. Florina? Polk? Sarah? Also Polk? I'm thinking Sarah. Time to activate the conversation. I feel something. I feel it. Someone's staring at me. It must be some poor... I don't understand why Sarah is like set up with Matthew. But then Sarah's the canon wife of Oswin, which is the result of which results in Wendy's, Wendy, Wendy's fucking existence. It's like they already had Wendy, and she was already like, like when they introduced Sarah, it's like fucking Wendy's mom, and you know Sarah can marry Oswin as she probably will. I'm going to give it to Sarah. Why is no one saying words? Chat. I like how all those people came in for like two seconds and they're not even here still. Or maybe my chat's just fucking up, which is a very real possibility. 
I got 5,000 gold. This is a mission I just saved for no reason. This is a mission where Florina can do really awesome things. Oh yeah, should I uh, get Nils to level 7? Should I do that? Should that be something I do? Nils is sort of Ninian, and Ninian's a girl. I'll probably use Ninian in this playthrough just purely because I'll probably have room in my team. I like how Ninian is objectively better than Nils because she has supports and he doesn't. Who could use an Iron Lance? Getting Nils to 7 um, unlocks the Guiding Guiding chapter. Where you get to see um, the extremely bizarre sequence with Nurgle. Hector mode only. Lin can get strength. Oh yeah, I need to remember to buy a heal staff because I'm going to run out. Very easy to run out of heal. Whoa, I forgot to kill that guy. No, no, he's going to destroy the village. Oh, there's a neat little Easter egg here in this level. Where the fuck is Matthew? Did I just not bring him along? If you send Matthew to that place, Hector's in that house. And if you send Matthew, there's custom text. Because Hector and Matthew know each other. Kind of neat. I guess I didn't bring him though, so fuck, whatever. You gotta finish this mission somewhat quickly. Because you're on a time limit to get the Gaiden chapter to get Ninny's Grace. But if you skip the Gaiden chapter, you still get Ninny's Grace, so like, I don't know. Why is a guy named Heinz? Catch up. Motherfucking face palm. What's wrong? Something on your mind? Oh, the crit and the the strength. That's all I needed. What are we looking at? You lose five to me, and I missed. Well, I won't kill him. Oh yeah, I forgot to vi visit the village and get my, my holy water. Mind blown. Oh, what did I say? Did I say... Oh, dude, I said facepalm. It's Eva mind blown. Yeah, I know. That's like the code to even input it. I am a donger this time. You are only striking at air is pretty much the coolest thing you can say when someone kills you. <laughs> that was Ursula. And here's Yubins? No. It's the guy who looks exactly the same as Yubins. I suppose I ought to bring along Matthew and Nils. Whoa. This looks fine. I'm not even going to bother to pick up the hammer. Well, no, the hammer is pretty good if you put it on Wallace. Does this guy have a lockpick? Yeah. Not just like a chest key. I hate that dude. In Hector Hard Mode, when uh, Legault joins you, he has two chest keys instead of a lockpick. It's like, why are you doing this to me, game? This is girls only. Matthew's only for opening chests and doors. And Nils doesn't attack anyone.
Got a vulnerary. Sick. Whoa. Ah, yes, magic. That was a decent level up. Ah, strength. Sick. I like to cheat a lot. Cheating is pretty much that thing I do. Ooh, you hit me. Now I'm gonna die. Matthew's a girl. Honestly, I won't even use Matthew. If it's that important. Can't be, they should be dead. He has Baird, the twin of humans. If you play Fire Emblem 6, there's a lot more face recycling, but I think uh, Paul and Jasmine, which is like, you know, they would look the same. And uh, Eubins and Baird are the only uh, face recycles in this game. And I don't think there's any in uh, Sacred Stones. I think they just didn't even fuck around with that. I'll get attacked by the mage, but I probably have like 10 resistance already. No, 6. So that's fine. Unless one of these guys has a uh, javelin, which will be pretty funny. Matthew opens chest, best thief. You like Matthew. You told me that. You got a man crush on Matthew. Nils also has good resistance, right? 4. His defense actually starts higher. Have I ever gotten Nils to max level? In fact, the highest level. Why is he breaking that wall? Does he even know what he's doing? How do I become the best fight man? I'm doing a video tutorial series. Watch all of them. That would be a good start. In order to become a good fight man, first you have to fight a lot. That's my best advice. I wonder if my Lin will be able to take on Lundgren. You have to have a decent Lin in order to beat Lundgren. Who's messaging me right now? I don't have time for all this shit. Florina's starting to get no experience. Lin's been getting no experience for a while. I could very easily die because of that play. Let's get Nils in there. Not Nils, but uh, Florina. Can I kill this guy? Yeah, actually. Now I probably won't die. Whoa, I might still die. Oh, that was close. Boogie has one frame link in our basic combo. What? Combo? Are you talking about what the hell combo does it, does Ibuki have that requires a one frame link that doesn't have like an easier version? Ibuki's a pretty hard character to start with, but like just because she's not fundamental, not because she's fucking super hard. Are you talking about low short, low jab? That's a one frame link, but it's a two frame link in Ultra. So just, you know, wait till the PC version gets the update and then you'll be fine. Yay, no screw level. I've only got to use him 60 more times. I cannot fail. He claims. <sighs> light Sumuji, light kick, medium kick special. It's actually light punch after light Sumuji, isn't it? Anyway, that's not... Um, I wouldn't call that bread and butter by any means. That's like the Sako link. Honestly, you could just do a different version of Sumuji, and it doesn't even lose that much damage. Instead of ever doing light Sumuji, you could just do um, um, the medium one and then do the down follow-up. You'd be losing less than 100 damage, and you'd still be getting the hard knockdown. Also, you can back blink it. It's far jab, far stand forward. I think Ibuki only has one stand forward. She might only have one jab. I think she has a close enough R jab. 
Yeah. I killed Baird. I got strength. Bunch of people I don't care about. Every Ibuki I see does it. Yeah, well, if you fucking you see the best Ibukis in the world, don't start from the top, start from the bottom. A good Street Fighter player takes into account what's practical and what's not. That's the truth. Online. Chia is best girl. You've been fighting some pretty good Ibukis. That's a hard link. Honestly, like, super hard links, like, that link doesn't add a whole lot of damage, and it puts you in a pretty big risk. A lot of links are inherently risky. What are you curs doing? Got some strength. Am I safe here? I'm not. I gotta do something like this. This looks ugly. But uh, whatever. Whoa, I'm killing the calves. That guy's gonna destroy that village, oh no. This is he's he's got this the land sword reaver, I think. It's not even a good item, but whatever. I rescued it. Uh why did I do that? Alright, it's fine. I'll just heal and then get out of the way. Heal, get out of the way. So when will you wreck me? Um tonight, maybe? I'm um I'm not an Ibuki player, but I'm probably 20 times better of an Ibuki player than you are. I have a general understanding of the game that allows me to play any character well. Am I about to literally, like, die? That's not going to kill me, is it? I've got full health. That better not kill me. Oh, he went for Lin. This is the game where it doesn't tell you how many ballista shots there are left. Now we got off. That must mean he's done. Lag was big when we played King of Fighters, but um, in my experience... Um, what am I trying to say? In my experience, uh, the lag that we played, when I play other people with similar lag in King of Fighters in Street Fighter, it's not even that bad. Then he trolls me by getting back on the ballista and shooting me. It'll be incredible. No strength. That's okay, I got a defense. My strength is actually pretty good. Level 11? That's higher than Lin, I think. No, it's the same. No, it's time for Lin to start doing some work. Oh, we played one game for Windows Live was the thing. Oh yeah, support ended for games for Windows Live version. The online is worse? I didn't know that. I figured it'd be better. Games for Windows Live is fucking dog ass. Someone said dog ass to me recently and I don't know, I just can't get it out of my head, it's hilarious. Here's the soldier with crit chance. The X Reaver has Five crit. 
even though he's got zero skill, he has a real chance of getting a crit. This is the only way you can see a soldier crit in this game. Here's a brigand with crit chance. Because the fucking sword weaver also has crit. I hope they'll fix it, yeah. Yo, dude, they're rebalancing the game. That made me happy. Did you see that? They, um... They said that balance isn't complete when it comes to Yun, Seth, and someone, DJ. So, that... Like, most people... Most Seth players have just dropped off the board. Like, Seth is probably the most nerfed character, despite not being the best character in the game. So, um... It's seriously looking like, uh... Like, Seth's gonna get an overhaul. Manikati fucks this guy worse than, like, any other guy. What's that? What's with that name, Yogi? I could probably just use the Manikati for, like, the rest of the entire playthrough. It's still got 20, plenty of uses. I think even if it breaks, you still get it back in, like, normal mode. I mean, in fucking Hector mode. So it doesn't matter. But I've never actually broken it. I just don't like using weapons like that. Uh, sword Reaver guy is going to fuck me unless I use the Ant Axe Reaver. Which will get make Yogi fuck me. I don't really care if the Sword Reaver guy fucks me. Buff Forte. Are you joking, dude? Forte got buffed to hell. Have you played him? Forte is, like, really good. Forte doesn't need buffs. If you know anything about Forte, Forte, like, Forte is way stronger than he was in old versions. That guy would have done hella damage to me. Kill him nice and slow? No. Murder him. I don't have a console. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, well they already buffed Forte, you're fine. Just wait till it comes out, and then you'll see. His changes are awesome. They made it so quesadilla bomb combos like from lights. It's super fast now. So now like holding a KC quesadilla bomb is really useful. And um what else let me think. Um EX quesadilla bomb uh is invincible, so it's a true reversal. So you've got EX runaway, you've got EX leg flip, which has less recovery, and you've got EX quesadilla bomb, so you've got three reversal options besides just backdashing and focus backdash and all that gay shit. Um Blocking. Um, EX KCD a bomb beats throws too, so like meaty throw. Like um, it will whiff punish the meaty throw. It's fast enough to do that at least. And meaty throw was really good versus Forte because like it beat all his options. Literally as Ryu, if I was fighting in El Forte, I would just like go up to him and wake up and just throw him. And like two things would happen. Okay? Well, three things. Either he would like, you know, take the throw, or he would EX run away and I'd throw him out of it and he would lose the bar and get knocked over again. And um, uh, sometimes he would EX leg flip out, my throw would whiff, and I'd sweep him in time to punish. And then I would do it again. The only thing El Forte has to beat meaty throw is uh, Ultra 1 or 2, which is awful. Not a good answer. I should have brought Matthew just to light the way. Should I use Wallace or not? I like haven't had a playthrough where I got Wallace in such a long time. I might no. Even though I'm probably gonna get him because I'm not gonna use like any of my lords. I'm probably not gonna I wouldn't use him anyway because he's male. And I can only use characters with the Giantus plus Hector. What am I looking at with these guys? That's not very good. I'll just stand here. No need to do this mission super fast. Such a QT independent woman. This is the best mission to level up Nils. Because uh, you can kill every enemy. After you get Nils, there's like no missions where you can kill every enemy. Except this one. And if you kill every enemy, you don't have to sit through an enemy turn, which is really good. Um, potentially risking my life here. Not really. But ouch, this is going to hurt. 
I guess I'll bring Wallace up, just because. I'm using my Manicotti. Everyone's hitting me. Everyone's hitting me. Sarah's gonna get targeted, but that's all right. She's a she's a strong old girl. She can take it. I'm still wasting hits on my Manicotti. Ooh, look at all these people. It's exciting. Let's kill this one. Let's get that heal off. I would call that important. Nils is going to die. Possibly the grand finals give me a boner. Don't spoil it, I haven't watched it yet. I slept through it. Don't tell me who won. I'm still wasting hits on my Manicotti. Absolutely no one took damage, except Florina. First order of business, free nails. Hashtag free nails. Second order of business, kill Archer, and or cut off his path. Uh, let's keep Wallace attacking people he can actually murder. Sarah should be okay, right? Cavalry is sort of more threatening. So I'll kill him. What is the reason you don't have a console? They're cheap now. Oh yeah, you're a Europe war. Video games suck for you, they're super expensive. The Myrmidon. This is like the only Myrmidon in all of Lin Mode. How to name him. He might be one of two. It would just be kind of funny if he had a name. Like the 4-3 archer. And, uh, got strength. Uh, German people have, um, affordable video games? I didn't know that. I know German video games are, like, fucking simulators for, like, not even... Like, not even what I would describe a video game. Here's here's Train train Conductor Simulator. It's like, wow, I don't, you know, I wouldn't want to do this in real life, and I wouldn't want to do it in a video game. Nil still has to gain, like, four levels. I did a lot of damage to both my characters. It's like a joke. I forget what the reason is. Plomp probably could pull it up. There's some game that's super popular on German Steamworks or something like that that's like not even like a game. It's like a simulator for something like fucking ridiculous. Euro truck simulator. I actually genuinely don't know what it is. This guy has a hand axe and if you can bait him into using it, he becomes a cinch. But I can't. This guy will fuck me up good if he hits me with both of his attacks. And he didn't. He dodged both my, uh... It was all a farce to get him to equip his hand axe so I could murder him. Forklift simulator? Yeah, see, that's what I'm talking about. I just want some stir. 
That'd be nice. There you go. That's a good level up. See, that doesn't like, I don't know, that doesn't strike me as like a, like a, a premise for a video game. Drive a forklift. But apparently that's like the kind of game that's super popular in Germany. Oh, I got a strength! Nils has a tiny, tiny, tiny strength growth. It's like 5%. 5% chance of getting strength. If you actually get Nils to max level, he's got a decent shot of getting one strength. But I got it pretty fast. I think he can also get skill. Might as well get Sarah back up there to heal his 1 HP that he lost. Man, I'm down to 50 minutes already. I hate this. I hate this little window between classes. I want to just play video games. I really want to miss this class. But it's the first class after my midterm, and they're going to give me back my midterm. Yeah, Nils is going to fuck you up with his one strength that he literally cannot use. He cannot equip a weapon. Wow. I could program a macro to just do this turn over and over, but it would be slower than just doing this turn over and over. Alright, level 5, only two more. Two more level ups. If I'm going to do Hector hard mode and do the Kishuna kill on all three, I'm probably going to need to do some arena -ing, which fucking... I try... I know I like... I like modify the stat growths I get often, but I really do hate arena -ing. I will try to avoid arena -ing whenever I can. I don't hate it, it's just like, you know... I, I feel like if I get a character super high level and the rest of the game's a pushover, like kind of kills the fun for the rest of the game. And arena -ing itself is pretty tedious, so. Alright. One more level. It's ten more flute plays. Eight more flute plays. You have to play Nils flute 70 times to get this stupid chapter. I understand why level 7. I guess that's just like the level where they decided like you would never do this on accident. Leveling Mills unlocks a, a secret later in the game. It's probably the most cryptic secret in any Fire Emblem game I've ever played. He's got a pretty good HP growth, I think. He seems to get HP like every, t every level up. Yeah. Alright, there we go. Level 7 Nils. I can get the Guide and Guide chapter. You can bring absolutely everyone for this mission. I will bring Wallace as a um a backup plan. Whoever kills that guy in the first turn, I bet no one. This guy can actually hurt my two mage ish units. Is this a good spot? The flying units, like, aren't flying units not even affected by what you're standing on? Except thrones. I'm not even getting the defense from the mountain or something. Oh no, he hit me. What a terrible thing that just happened.
I hate the rain in this level. It's just something that like doesn't even like factor into rain in general. Like rain, it doesn't even. I feel like it was used in all the G GBA strategy games except like Tactics Ogre Knights of Lotus, and it doesn't do anything. It does stuff. Snow is a factor in Advanced Wars. Rain in Advanced Wars seems to only exist because snow exists in Advanced Wars. Which is a bit dumb, but whatever. Yay, magic. And I give Nels my energy ring. I wonder if there's ever been anyone who maxed Nils' strength. Because you can. He starts at level 1. And um, you can grind to get him a strength every level up. And then just give him an energy ring when he has 19 at level 20. You can max Nils' strength pretty easily. I shouldn't say pretty easily, but like with save states pretty easily, you know? You know? Why can't I ford this river? Some classes can ford rivers. What's up with that? Yo, Sarah, where are you? You need to answer a question for me. What, what classes can ford rivers? What's the ding-dong dealio? Why don't I play Advanced Wars? It's a shit game. It's literally Fire Emblem without anything fun. None of your characters have personality. Fucking the maps are a million times more tedious because both sides have bases and they can just make shit over and over. It's like Fire Emblem when they were experimenting with fucking how to make the game awful. I don't even hate Advanced Wars. I think it's pretty fun. But like, I think that Advanced Wars... Um, I feel like the most fun missions in Advanced Wars... Okay, the AI makes it so every level just has a solution. Like, you know, because there's no characters with individual stats, you can just go through a level... Like, once you've done it once, you can do it any number of times. And it's the same every single time. So the only fun of Advanced Wars comes from your very first playthrough, when you don't know how to beat all the levels. But once you know how to beat all the levels, it's just a non-factor. Um... And when both sides, like, like with missions where both sides have an approximately equal army, or, like, maybe your army is smaller, but you have to, like, win, like, by superior tactics or something like that, those missions are really fun. Excuse me. But, um, you know, they tend to succumb more easily to the, there's a definitive solution to things. And the missions where there are bases don't succumb to that as easily. They still do. But, um, um, if, if you have a base and the opponent doesn't have a base, it's ridiculously easy. And if you both have bases, like both you and your opponent, then it's ridiculously stalemate -y. And it's like, you know, I'm going to keep making things and he's going to keep making things. And you tend to win just based on the AI being literally retarded. And on instances when the AI isn't literally retarded, then it's just you, you know... It's just a super long battle of attrition. That's why I don't like Advanced Wars. It is really easy, but it's really easy just because the AI is dumb. It's really easy for a really dumb reason. The AI doesn't know how to play the game. War of spamming shit! That's literally what Advanced Wars is. <gasps> why did I do that? Holy fuck. Let's attack him from this side so I don't attract Lundgren's attention. Lance Reaver and the Many Caddy are both really useful for, um... Oh, I got strength. I've actually got, like, enough strength that... I might be able to kill Lundgren pretty easily. We'll find out. We'll find out. He's doing hella damage to me. He's got a really good shot of doing... I'll bait him for an attack before I do anything. Oh, the rain. The worst possible time. Why is this javelin beating... Oh, I'm using an armor slayer. Thought I was using the Lance Reaver. Mech pretty much everything on the ground. Mechs are incredibly cheap and incredibly strong. No, the Fire Emblem's not the same every time because your characters have individual level-ups that are randomized, and there are a million different characters to use. 
or not a million different characters, but a million different character combinations. Like, there's a lot of replay value using characters you've never used before. Or like pairings you've never used before, utilizing the support system. You know? The support system makes it so like each individual pair of characters can bring something new to the table. That being said, I usually go through playthroughs now where I don't even like use a different support. Oh dude, this is like the most based run of all time. Did I really just kill Lundgren that easy? I didn't even get a good level up, but whatever. Literally, you can go on Game of FAQs if you're so inclined and just look up a turn-by-turn -turn walkthrough to beat a level in Advance Wars. And something like that in Fire Emblem would, like, could not happen because it's so personalized to which characters you're using. If you've been using Marcus the entire game... Oh yeah, the energy ring. Holy fuck, I nearly didn't use that. Oh god, I would have lost two strength. Uh, Lynn's fine. Florina's fine. Sarah will be fine eventually. I could honestly use it on any of them. Um, Florina? Oh yeah, there's no RNG element to um, Advanced Wars. Or a very, very small one. Very small. That's You could argue that's more tactical. But it also decreases replay value. Dude, who gets the ring? Lin or Florina? Florina's less likely to cap strength, but Lin it'll ultimately be more useful. But like... I don't know, dude. I could, I'm going to be using Lin probably less, because she's already level 15 and she maxes at level 20. And then I'm not going to use her for like half the game over half the game until like chapter fucking 21 when you get a promotion item for no not even 21 like it's like 24 or something give it to Nils I'm not even going to count that as a vote Sarah what do you think Florina will not get within two strength of maxing strength unless she's incredibly lucky so giving it to Florina is not a bad idea giving it to Lynn she's I don't know Lin with strength is pretty much... Lin's, the only thing that can ruin Lin is bad strength and bad defense, but whatever. Lin's defenses are so awful. Get Florina. I didn't need that iron sword that I bought that one time. I gave it to Florina. And I also got Nils to level 8. I guess that's one more heal for um, Sarah. Level 7. Level seven's like the amount that I always try for whenever I play this game. I always want to get Sarah to level 7 in the prologue. So let's do Hector hard because I'm a man. I really hate Hector hard so I don't know why I did that. So this is going to be really hard because Matthew is the fucking exact level he starts at and Hector's uh, the exact level he starts at. This mission is really difficult if you didn't level up Matthew. It's not really difficult but like, you know, it's a chore. It's decently hard. I missed. He stood in like the worst spot. I'm willing to use hits of my wolf bail. Oh yeah, he's got a vulnerary. I hate this guy. Um, he's probably going to use his vulnerary, so I'm just... <gasps> the thief is already here! God damn. I don't even have a fucking... God damn it, dude. I hate this mission. I want to steal his uh, lockpick really badly. But I'd rather have... The red gem. <sighs> Look at all this. That thief is about to unlock that door. I can get over here. I can make it in time. Oh, nice level. Matthew's fine. 
For some bizarre reason, this thief unlocks this door. Um, which is good for me. Got the lockpick. He might steal it back. Is he the same speed as me? Yeah, he is. He might steal it back. I might be locked into a stealing war with that guy. Let's um, seize a pulmonary. Yep, he stole it back. This is free experience, actually. I get 10 experience every time I steal from him. It's kind of funny when you see a stealing war. Um, I really need to kill one of these guys. Why did I do that? I really need to kill one of these guys. I could have just used another vulnerary. Uh, that's fine. He'll get strength anyway. What's this bullshit, dude? What's this bullshit? I think it wire. Strangest name in any video game. That guy's got a vulnerary too. Definitely gonna steal that. This guy's got a vulnerary I just get. So I'm gonna get it, so I might as well use this one. I'm gonna go ham on stealing the vulnerary because I'm gonna need them all. Nice crit. Nice level. Once this guy doesn't have enough speed. <laughs> Uh, he might just attack me if I get a level up and I get speed, which Matthew usually does. He's got like a 60% speed growth. Uh, did I get it? Am I 12? Yeah, I'm 12. So he might attack me. I don't know what he does. He might run over to Hector. He might just flee. Oh yeah, he's attacking me. It's actually really bad. Because I don't think I have a fucking vulnerary. Oh god, did I bone myself? <laughs> oh god, I boned myself. <laughs> Is this real life? Oh, he's only got a 70% chance of hitting me, so I can win like that. All I've got to do is dodge one attack. I would still... When I play this game on GBA, I never ever use save states, but honestly, like, save states just cut out a lot of the bullshit that I hate. So, I'm sort of, like, it would be less enjoyable. I like playing this game fast. When I play video games, I like I like playing games fast. Attention speed guy, please slow down. You ever see those? Those are great. I just need to, like, I need him to miss me. If he misses me, I'll be alright. Layla! Layla! You got me on my knees, Layla! I'm begging, darling, please, Layla! Darling, won't you ease my worried mind? Something like that. Wow, I didn't realize that like him stealing from me was like the only reason I wasn't about to die. FE speedrun. They're um they're actually kinda cool. FE speedruns are unfortunately like basically Marcus playthroughs. There's not a whole lot of interesting stuff about the route. I'm probably gonna need a little bit of health on Matthew. So let's use that vulnerary. I'll certainly get more. He's gonna. Eat. Oh, he didn't. I was all fucking afraid. So I can't steal, but I can trade. And then steal. And then I can kill him. Gotta use the hand axe, because the hand axe is easily replaced. Does guy have a javelin? No. That means I can steal and rescue. Have the red gem. Fun when Burton got ultra shit RNG on AGDQ. They had to cut his run. I think that's not even why they cut his run. Although it was ultra shit RNG. I think that uh, I think that people didn't like the Fire Emblem speed run. This guy has a very tiny chance of critting me, which would be fucking awful if it happened. I guess uh, Hector didn't get luck in one of his level ups or something. Forgive me, Lord Nurgle. Nice level. So now I have not one but two women on the team. I am not going to bullshit myself and just not use Hector. I'm going to use Hector. But the rest of my team is going to be all women. And I'm not going to use Hector that much. Because fucking he's going to get to level 20 and then I'm just not going to worry. 
Sarah is, um, yeah, it was like 30 minutes behind the schedule, but like honestly, he wasn't 30 minutes from the end of the game. His projection was a fucking. Well, I don't know. I feel like he could have beaten the game in the projected time. I don't know. Look at this, dude. Hector's awesome. Not gonna do it though. Instead, I'm gonna go down here and attack this guy. And hopefully, hit him. Cool. Um, I don't consider this a bad play, but I do consider it cheating for my girls' only playthrough. I guess I'll move Elwood over here. It's okay if he gets a little bit of experience here and there. You miss an energy ring from not doing Elwood mode, but both these guys have iron axes, which is cool. And I think um. Yeah, I get a, a iron sword on Marcus, which is cool. Let's um, let's give you an iron sword. I believe Elowood in Elowood, his rapier is one of a kind in Hector mode, which is problematic. Problematic. Bache looks like a fucking retard. I didn't know this until recently, but Geitz's growths are like identical to Geese's, except he actually has resistance. When I found that out, it made like Geitz into the coolest character ever to me. Um, this guy is gonna kill me if I let him. Matthew's gonna fucking die. Matthew's not gonna die. Matthew's gonna fucking die. Well, we'll see. Can I just hit this guy with an axe? Oh god, Dorsus is gonna fucking die. Please tell me I can do something to this guy. All my characters. Bartray, be powerful. Oh god, I get doubled. Bartray's that slow. What's well, Bartray's speed? Is it like five? Three. Ooh. Um, I gotta have Lowen hit him to kill. Lowen would probably not be in terrible danger from the one axe guy who can reach him. Lowen's got a good defense. Lowen's a wall. Let's have Lowen hit him. It's sort of an emergency situation because I haven't ironed out all my shit yet. Sarah's gonna die right now. Sarah didn't die. Oh, that guy went and fucking stood on a... That's funny. A fortress. <gasps> Did I really attack with Javelin? Oh my god, dude. Sarah's gonna die because of that. Fortunately, Hector is powerful. I gotta resist. One of my friends had a playthrough where Hector naturally max resist. It's unlikely, but it can happen. This guy's gonna swoop down and just kill someone. He's gonna kill Marcus. I have a secret book. Elowood's stats honestly don't need any sort of attention. It'd be really cool if I could hit this guy. Oh, no. I wouldn't make that kind of brisk in, in no save state. That's the thing, is like, um... Oh god, why did I approach with fucking Dorsius? No save state, like what options are good options changes a lot. I I take really stupid risks. Can we just have this guy die? 64. Alright, cool. How am I even supposed to kill this guy? Everyone's wounded. I don't even think Elowood can do like 9 damage, yeah, at all, ever. Under any circumstance. That was dumb. I'm better off leaving the archer alive. Um, what are my chances of survival? I 
Enemies usually don't leave fortresses unless they have full health. Their AI is really weird about fortresses. Did I really just let Elowood die? I didn't even do any of my actions down there. That was dumb. Let's kill this guy. Then hit this guy. Whoa! Hit him with Rebecca. I didn't realize he was wounded. I really ought to get Marcus up there. Hector laughs at your petty. I need to kill that guy on that thing before he like gets any smart ideas. The boss is probably going to fuck Oswin up. I do not want that. Alright, this guy is finally not a problem. That 1% crit makes me laugh. <gasps> Did I just... No, I'm fine. No, I'm not. He's got a X. And X. I want to see what happens. Um, Hector's got to get out of here. Sort of everyone's got to get out of here. Let's put Hector last, though. I could just rescue um, Sarah with Oswin. Knights are really awesome for rescuing because their skill and speed drops don't even matter that much. Skill drop, like, doesn't really matter. Skill's not a very important stat. And, um, you know, they got the defense to tank hits. Even doubles. It's not too bad to get doubled if you're a knight. Hector on a forest would be really good at defending. I could just go up with Oswin and hit this guy. I've got a pretty tiny chance of hitting him. And this guy probably has like a fucking armor slayer. What's it what's the what's the axe that beats armor? What's the name of that axe? I can't think of what the axe that beats armor is called. I can't even think if there is one. Zombato is no, that's the sword that beats horses. Exit. Wow, fuck. Whatever. Hammer. Hammer's the axe that beats armor. There we go. All came into focus. Yeah, I got it. Got it in time. Uh, let's get Elowood up here and have him use 100 vulnerabilities. Let's get Marcus up here just in case I need to whack the boss. Armor Reaver. <laughs> oh shit, he one-shotted me. I was not expecting that. Let me um let me heal up. Cool. That's better. Hector needs to get out. Everyone needs to get out. Let's get Sarah out here. Is there any single spot I can stand to just stop that guy from attacking Sarah? Here. Elwood needs to party. Marcus needs to party. Alright. So, um, swap out. Well, I've got the talk. I'll go to the armory, though. Sell the red gem. Unfortunately, that's the only way to make money in uh, Hector mode. You need to buy some axes. Maybe. I don't have a... I don't have Merlinus yet, so I can't overload. I'll buy a iron sword. I'll definitely use an iron sword at some point during the playthrough, so whatever. Look at all that damage. Marcus, can you kill him without killing him? No. What if I, like, hmm, no. I can't rescue someone with Marcus and then still attack. I ought to fall back more. I can't do this with all my existing characters unless I just have Marcus kill someone. Which I don't want to do. What if I did... this? Then I would just kill him slower. 
Um, with an Iron Lance, maybe? Or even a Javelin? Javelin's like the weakest option I have. I could just scum for a miss. Or this is not as easy as it seemed. Just miss with a Silver Lance. It's only got an 80% chance of hitting. My chances of hitting two 80s in a row is 64%. Is it really that low? That can't be right, can it? 0 0.8 times 0 0.8 is 0 0.64. I didn't realize hitting two 80s in a row was so unlikely. That can't be right. What's going on? That's how you calculate two events in a row, isn't it? What the fuck? 65%? I'm getting it more than 65% of the time right now. Maybe there's some... Oh yeah, well, fucking uh, Fire Emblem uses uh, percentage rounding. So... Oh, I missed him. Excellent. Kill with girl. Nice. That speed and skill. This should honestly be fine. Rebecca! I could just kill this guy with fucking... Rebecca. Um, let's gear up. I should have bought a bow, honestly. Whatever. I never read your message, PC. We can play. That was an age ago. I might as well do the, the talk. Just cause. Ella Wood, are you alright? I fucking did the talk and then I skipped it. Am I fucking serious? That was a good level up, so even though I didn't get strength, I'm not even mad. Strength is, like, objectively the best stat. Um, I'll send my nice, nice armor units over this way. Nice, powerful armor. Maybe Marcus, too. Argus will be useful down here. Got some iron axes now. I'm ready to take on the world. I think in Hector hard mode there are 100 billion enemies that spawn in this mission. I think Ellawood mode is like the hardest version of this mode because I think there's like a... I don't know if it's Ellawood mode only. There's like an archer and a, a soldier who spawn from these two like four turns in a row. It's just like, God damn it, go away. There's pretty much nothing... There's no reason to rush this mission. The only thing is you want to get here before anyone destroys it. And you want to get to Merlinus before you miss the Gaiden. And then you can just sort of go slow. And there's Guy. He has bonus stats because this is hard mode. He normally has 6 strength, but now he has 8. It, I feel like his other stats are higher too. But I know the strength is higher. Bonk. Not girl, shouldn't be attacking. Whatever. If he grills. There sure are a lot of enemies down here. Rebecca's in inordinate danger. Did I really miss? That sucks. Um, Rebecca probably won't die, right? We'll see what happens. Oh, do she definitely didn't die. She did all kinds of not dying. That was some not dying expertise I just saw. That guy's already like on his way. He can already make it in one turn. I've got to present the target for him. See, that's... that's Hard mode is hard. That's impressive how fast they got someone down there. This guy's probably going to fly for Dorcius. I'm going to put him on a forest. 
Dorks. That guy's nearly dead. What am I looking at for? Oh, that guy's nearly dead. Decisions. Let's take this one. I'm gonna miss. Nope. Don't you have classes? Oh shit, it's twelve forty five. I've gotta go at twelve fifty, which is um like almost now. I put him in range. And then he destroys the fucking mine anyway. I need that mine, that mine is useful. Mines are arguably the best item in the game. Because of stupidness. Yes, he got a speed. Four speed. His speed starts so fucking low. Three. That's annoying. I hate that. Whatever. That will kill me. Do you have a hand axe? God damn it. Fuck. I can't safely do this, because I've got to rescue Rebecca. That's stupid. Okay. Mm That's fine. I don't think it's said enough, but Elowood has a really godlike dodge animation. I'm going to fall back. I'm going to grab that mine and fly away. Hector will be fine. Hector's the best character in the game. That was Nime. No, not Nime. Nime is Canis's mom. Who is that? Sarah? No, Hannah. Hannah the fortune teller. Well, Ella would be fine. Let's find out. Rebecca, well, mm, I got hit. That was unlikely. <gasps> what the hell? I pulled Guy. I forgot you could pull Guy. I've got to get out of here. Oh, dude, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I forgot Guy moved. You're not supposed to be able to pull a guy like that. Well, at least this turn's incredible difficulty will be allayed by the fact that um, guy will be attacking some of the enemies. I can kill this guy, but he's probably not going to hit anyone. No, I'm going to stick around until I beat this mission. It'll be fine. Maybe not beat this mission, but kill all these guys. I can be vaguely late to this class. It actually starts at 110, so and I can bike there in 10 minutes. I just like to leave 20 minutes early. I bike to all my classes because I'm a college student and I'm poor. I do not want to buy um, parking permits and shit. This sure is a lot of enemies. This guy's going to die. <gasps> Whoa, I missed him. Um, we're going to try and play that off. We're going to try and pretend that didn't matter. Let's kill this one. Convincing case that that didn't matter. Everyone's wounded. If anything, me missing him saved the hit off of that fucking killing edge. Not bad. Um, want to pull this calf? I'm gonna go do stuff. You're leaving. You're the whole reason I stream. I just, I'm just like Sarah. Got a stream for Sarah. Sarah? Really? Fuck. I'm dumb. Whoa, that guy's here! I forgot to ever go get Merlinus. 
Oh my god, he better not leave next mission, or next turn. I just use the mission, word mission way too much. If he leaves next turn, I'm going to be so embarrassed. Honestly, I do like having you around a lot. No homo. But like, you know. Ooh, nice level. Sarah, please notice me. <laughs> I am very grateful of all of my my small small fan base, my small collective of dedicated fans. Hector's dying, and I did not realize. More like rape your. That was a shitty level up. Who gets the secret book? That was a misplay. Whoa, I st I'm still spending turns not getting Merlinus. Still got him in time. You don't get anything for that mission. You get Merlinus like three levels sooner. Doesn't matter. Whatever. If you'd only stream regularly. Dude, I'm like... Uh. Uh, uh, it's hard. Struggle is real. I'm only at home, or I'm only at a place where a computer is half the time. Which makes it really difficult for me to stream regularly. I got, got that defense. Got that speed. It's a fine level. Those Pegasus are going to start being really annoying really soon. So here are the characters that I care about. Now that I've done the hard part of that mission. Let's um let's try to get some kills. Without using um I swear I can just gauge distances in this game now. I don't hate FE Girls, it's like the best game I've ever played. Oh, I'm killing these guys, I didn't want to kill them. I'm going to intentionally let him attack Rebecca, I think. Oh shit, where's he going? We're not going to let this happen. Come back. Oh god, he attacked me. The juke! The bait and switch! That was clever. Um, these two probably yeah, can support, because I stood them next to each other. Um... Wolf Bell would be the easiest and most straightforward way to do this. What if he crits me? 1% chance, 51% chance of even hitting. Fuck off, boys. That was a bad level up. I'm going to let him attack me. Whenever it's different. Still the same RNG. Kuretsky, you came at the worst possible time. I'm about to stop. Uh, I think I'm broke. Right? Yeah, I got 320 gold. I've got a secret book to sell, which I like am genuinely considering selling. Got the torch to sell. Bunch of vulnerabilities, but they're worth nothing. I got that silver lance, but I don't want to sell it. Got nothing that can generate me money. Kuretsky, you just woke up. Hey, I heard that you broke your toe. Is that true? Did you break your toe? I guess I did stick around until I finished the mission. I forgot how fast it was once you clear that uh, group. And I got the side quest. This side quest is actually really hard, especially if you don't use every single character. And in Hector Hard Mode, it's, like, really hard. It's a really hard mission. It's probably the... Before you really sort anything out and start getting high levels, uh, Plump told me. We gossip about you sometimes. Where, like, Kuretsky's, like, the coolest guy on the entire internet. That's what we say. Got that speed, got that luck. Yeah. Whatever. Whatever. Uh, how, how well are you doing this mission is pretty much reflective of... Um, oh, Plump here. Kuretsky shows up, Plump shows up. That's how it works. <laughs> nice. 
Get that kill. Got HP and luck. Too low in stats. I think Lowen actually gets a shit ton of luck. Um, someone has a sword, but I forget who. I think it's I think it's Lowen or Oswin. I didn't plan this. It's just convenient. I honestly should have picked up Merlinus with Bartre. I'm going to regret not doing that. Also, Sarah got attacked. Zero percent chance of hitting me. Best motto, who needs education? That's almost where I am right now. I'm like seven weeks from graduating. I'm nearly done. I'm honestly at like a fuck it state right now. I've reached a point where I'm just saying fuck it. That is not a good play, unless I should not do it. Can I kill? No, can't double. Rebecca's actually fucking doing hella work. That fucking 11 speed. I don't think she's gotten the strength since I got her though, which is kind of annoying. The heck is doing hella work with that good everything. Lowen, kidnap, run away. Um, this is fine. I'm gonna get the money because I actually need it. Oh, the boss is coming down the side. I hate when he does that. And I just got killed by a bandit. Now the last term, I've already gotten all my good grades that I need to like pass, so the last term is far less important than you would think. Nice crit. All right, let's. Uh, I'm gonna keep that. Let's uh, scum for a chance. If anything looks bad, that's um, that's bad. This is bad. This is what I would call bad. This is a bunch of really bad things. Bunk. Oh, I got hit too. Jesus Christ, look at them all. Guy has a decent chance of dying. My entire team has a good, decent chance of dying. Bah, Lindis and her cadre. Oh god, Ellawood's gonna die. That guy's trapped. He's a vulnerary. Let's see what terrible mistake I made. Is it gonna be Guy? Is Guy gonna be my terrible mistake? Oh, nice level. Well, I haven't lost yet. Nope, I lost. Let's just stand here. It's a fine spot to stand. It's like 58. It's 12.58. Baph, is this a 24-hour stream? What a cool idea. 24-hour stream. I should do that. What were my plays? I forgot my plays. I think I did all this. And then I think Bartray did nothing. No, oh, Bartray stood on top of the... the, the oh, fuck. That was a misplay. Still a good level up. Oh, I got attacked an extra time. Bartre was supposed to attack this guy. He'd be dead right now. That's a very low chance of hitting. Which is disappointing. Marcus, make this man dead. Make this man dead. Use kill. <gasps> she can't kill either of them. That is so annoying. God, 
sky is fucking trapped. Thor should just be useful. I should have healed. I had to heal. Uh, Elowit has a really good chance of... Oh god, I missed. Elowit has a fucking guaranteed chance of dying. I don't know where the enemies are. Which is bad. As you would expect. Rebecca be a target. If I don't die, I'll be impressed. And I didn't die. Cool. One oh one. Starting to push it. Starting to push it. Rebecca, can you kill? Can you use kill Rebecca? No. It. Damn. I'm just going to leave that. I really want to keep Marcus around. I'm sending Rebecca over. <laughs> Fuck, there's a guy. I didn't remember that. Oh, he might have come down from there. Trying to destroy this place. I forgot they went that way. This is a fine spot. Didn't get stir. These guys have a really good chance of killing Dorcius. He doesn't have a vulnerary, and I don't want to steal Sarah's. He's on a forest, he'll be fine. Famous last words. Where the fuck is the boss? I'm not going to move from this spot. The spot's too strong. I might kill that guy. I think that guy seems strong too. I can't kill. I don't even get doubled when I'm holding someone. This guy must have like fucking less than 4 speed total. Nice crit. Ha, ah, looks like you breathed your last. Well, Bartre is still alive. Just short. I can use uh, Elowood to secure the kill. But this feels very, very dangerous. Like I could die any second. Nearly used up my Iron Lance. Alright, let's hit a 51. Damn. Alright, let's, let's, let's hit a 51. 104. Getting late. Starting to almost be late for class. It's got a hand axe. That means I'm not gonna kill him. How will I lose on the last turn? Nope, didn't. Everyone's leaving. It's my cue to leave. Don't need you. Wait! No. I need Sarah. And that's all. Right? Yeah. 104 still here. Yep. Fuck the police. Marcus is now useless. Loam was always useless. Bartre was useless. Looks like a solid team. Got four characters. I ought to bring Marcus and give him a lance. Look at 
like all these iron lances I have. 